Welcome back to Let's Roger That, and here's a quick tip for you owners of PDM30 King milling machines. Check it out. If you watched my last episode, you've seen that I've replaced the uh, lead screw nut for my X axis. And that is because, look at those threads, completely worn out. Well, what's interesting is that they're worn out on one side. And, if, and I've been wondering why. Well, as I'm reassembling my mill here, I discovered why. Now, if you look at this nut, the tightening bolt for your threads, that's for the backlash relief, is here, right? Well, mine was installed in, let me see in this fashion. Well, as it turns out, it needs to be installed this way, okay? If it's installed in this orientation, the lead screw actually has to be, you know, uh, is at an angle and therefore applies a considerable amount of pressure on the one side. So let's look at what side would be. Yes, it would be on the back side, which means the lead screw is pushing in that direction, which made complete sense because when I tried to put it on, these bolts just were not aligning on one side. So let's look underneath uh, the right side and show you the orientation. Okay, so we're looking <laughs> underneath the uh, the main bed, right? You know, of course, I'm shaking, sorry about that. And as you see, the adjustment bolt is on the right side, which is facing the back of the mill. Now, there is no sideways pressure at all anymore on this lead screw nut. Therefore, it performs really, really well. I mean, it's smooth as silk. There's no tension being felt anymore. And that is just... What a stupid mistake at the company. Whoever assembled this thing really screwed up. So if you uh, just purchased a PDM30, I strongly suggest you look underneath this thing before you start using it and wear out your, your lead screw nut. If you've already got one of those things, well, I still suggest that you look underneath it and uh, make sure it gets installed in the correct orientation. So I hope you enjoyed this tip. Uh, please like and subscribe and thanks for watching. Take care. Bye bye.